Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, with twat. Yeah, you already know, man. It's your boy, Mr. With twat. And today, 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 I'm going to be doing that Q&A. <laughs> Let's go ahead and just start this off from the beginning. I know y'all started watching a couple of videos. Maybe it came up on recommendations or something. And y'all were like, yo, who is this dude, man? What? He called himself Mr. Wattois. What, what does Mr. Wattois mean? What, what is all this? He over here doing all this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. First of all, let's go ahead and get this thing started. The first question is, when did I start YouTube? Now, we're going to answer this as far as being Mr. Watois because I, I was doing YouTube back in like 2000 and I was doing YouTube back in like 2008, 2007, 2008, but I was doing music with it and I was going by the name of Vic, um, Vic Too Hot. Now, Mr. Watois, I started doing Mr. Watois. If y'all go to my videos and go to the video called my thoughts on Irene Challenge, um, my thoughts on the Irene Challenge, uh, Kanika Jenkins video. It says published September 19, 2017. That was the first video I uploaded as Mr. Watwa. So basically you can say that's when I started doing YouTube as far as like not really just making music and doing it, but actually like doing YouTube, like, you know, making reactions, doing funny videos, you know, stuff like that. So that's the video. That was my very first YouTube video as far as being Mr. Watwa was that video right there. Um, so that was September 19, 2017. And today is, what's today's day? Today is Wednesday, December 6, 2017. So you got September, October, November, December. So I can't really count December like that. So we're going to say two months. I've been doing YouTube as Mr. Watwa for two months. Uh, the time of this video, let's see, the date of this video, oh, no, 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 at the date of this video, I am at 16,786 subscribers, okay, now, the other question was, now, the other question was, where did Mr. Watwa come from, the actual name, Mr. Watwa, Mr. Watwa, <clears throat> when I was making music, uh, this was about two years ago. I started. I started because I was doing. What, I was doing music like 2000. And, I was doing music like 2005, 2004. But it was two years ago. I started doing music like Afro beats. You know, Caribbean, Jamaican, African, like Afro beats, like them nice. You know, reggae type. You know, music. You know, what I'm saying you can move to. And when I uh, was doing those those type of music, I had to come up with a new kind of um, ad lib. Like I couldn't do my regular ad libs that I was doing on like American songs, because when you come to like a Jamaican, African, Caribbean type music, you really can't bring them kind of ad libs over there. It's a different kind of music style. So I still wanted to stay, you know, turned up or whatnot. So that's when I came out with I was recording with my boy, and then out of nowhere, I just said. <laughs> like it was an ad lib. I just came out of nowhere. I was like, you know, trying to do the ad libs, and out of nowhere, it was just like, what? What? And he played it back, and I was like, yeah, I like it. He was like, you sure you like it? I was like, yeah, I like that, man. It sounds cool. So every time I would make a song, I would always put that ad lib in there, and then out of nowhere, I just got people started just calling me Mr. What's What because that's what they um, got back from the song. Like whenever I came, I'd be like, What's What? Yeah, you know, so Mr. Watwa was born. So that's how I got the name Mr. Watwa because people were calling me Mr. Watwa because I kept saying Watwa in my ad libs. So, um, what's the other question? So, yeah, that's how Mr. Watwa came about. And I like the name. Watwa is pretty cool. Um, people ask me, what, what does Watwa mean? Watwa is a word that I made up. It's, it's basically a word that um, it just describes like what you're doing. Like, if you went to a party and the party was like turned up or lit, you can say, yo, that party was a twat up. Or if you, but it, you know, if you went to like, okay, let's say you eat something good and you eating and you like, yo, man, how that thing taste, man? That thing was twat, bro. Like, well, twat is just a good word. Like when you want to describe something, but you want to keep it between you and your friends, you know, like that one special word nobody knows. But if you say it to your friends, like they understand it, you know what I'm saying? So that's what a twat is. That's why it's just a cool way to describe something that you don't want to say. But it means, to me, when I say it, it's lit. 
Like, yo, I'm with Twat up. If I if I say with Twat, I'm lit. I'm ready. Let's go. I'm pumped. I'm excited. I'm happy. Like, let's get it popping. With Twat does not mean nothing negative. You can't use with Twat with something negative. It don't. That's not how it works. So, with Twat family, if y'all want to use it, y'all can say with Twat. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can say it with your friends. You know, come up with cool little sayings with it. I don't mind. All right. The next question is: Do you pray? Do you like to pray? Yes, I like to pray. I'm Roman Catholic, so I pray all the time. You know what I'm saying? I pray all the time. I pray all the time. I pray. I pray before I even do a video. Um, before I do videos, I pray. Uh, before I do something new on YouTube or about to do anything, I always, you know, talk to my God. You know, let Him know what I'm about to do. Ask for Him for, you know, ask Him to protect me. And um, but yeah, I, I pray a lot. Uh, I might not do the traditional praying like. You know, like everybody else does, but I do pray. I pray a lot. Like I, do, it would be real quick. Like I just, man, yeah. just like that, straight like that. Like it's real quick. You know what I'm saying? I just pray for y'all. Pray for myself. I just pray for my family just now, and I pray for y'all to get good too. Y'all to be well. Y'all health. Y'all wealth. I pray for me and my family, my friends. So, yeah, that's how I do. I pray. I believe in. I believe in the Lord, Jesus Christ, our Savior. Man, let me stop, man. I can't. I'm, I'm not. I'm supposed to keep this just Q and A, man. Y'all about to turn me into um, Mr. Watoa right now, for real. Hold on. All right, what's the other question? We got one from. Oh, this is from A. Rodney Gaming. What's up, A. Rodney Gaming? What's popping, bro? What's popping? What's popping? All right, he got four questions. Oh, it might be a she. I don't know. He or she. I can't really tell from the um, from your uh, avatar or your profile pic. It's just got your um, initials A and R. So. First question you got. Well, I'm going to read all the questions and I'm going to answer it. The um, questions are, what's your favorite color, food, and movie? Are you crazy? <laughs> are you crazy? What's your full name? And that's all I got for now. Oh, okay, right. That, was, that wasn't four questions. That was three questions. All right, the first question I'm going to answer is, what's your favorite color, food, and movie? My favorite color is orange. That's my very favorite color. I know y'all have never really seen me wear it, but my favorite color is orange. Orange, straight like that. I like red and I like black. I like stuff like that when I'm wearing clothes. Like if I'm wearing clothes, I like black. I like red. I like like nice solid colors. But orange is my favorite color. My favorite type of food. <sighs> I don't have a favorite food. I have a favorite combination of food. I like pizza and fries or pasta. Like I like breading. Like I know it's carbs and stuff, but I like pasta. Or pizza and fries, like those. That's it. Like it's hard. And chicken wings, man. This is hard, man. Cause I like chicken wings, man. Y'all, y'all, y'all see me tearing up them chicken wings, man. I'm, I'm gonna put the link up here to my video. I tearing up them chicken wings. I, 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 I tearing up them chicken wings, bro. But uh, nah. But I have to answer this. My favorite, 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 favorite food. Pasta. Yeah, it's pasta. It's my favorite. I, but I love pizza though, and I love fries, and I definitely love some chicken wings. Give me some flats, man. I pull them things like like crazy, bro. Straight like that. My favorite type of movie is Saw. I mean, I like Friday. I like um, I like all the comedy movies. But if I if it, if it's a movie that I'm gonna watch over and over and over and over and over, it's Saw. Straight like that. I like gore. I like um action movies like action gore. Saw is funny a little bit because you know they be they be they be cussing up in there, but. That's my favorite movie, Saw. And yes, I watched the Saw that came out this year, and that thing was so lit. Oh, I was up in there, turned up. Uh, the other qu question he asked, are you crazy? Yeah, I'm crazy as a mug, boy. I'm, I'm, I'm crazy as a mug, bro. Damn, I don't... Yeah, yeah, I'm crazy, bro. Straight like that. Because you got to be crazy to come out here and do all this crazy stuff on YouTube, bro. So I'm crazy, hell yeah, I'm crazy. All right, we got one from Cynthia's African Hair Braided. Now, let me tell you something about this girl, Cynthia. Um... I don't know where you from, but I'ma tell you right now. A brother needs some. I need some like some some kind of moisture in there. You know what I'm saying? I need you to hook me up with some 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 kind of moisture to put up in here. And I need my hair whether dreaded up or braided. Like I need something to this hair. You see, every time I get on these videos, I just be coming out with this. You see this? You see this? Cynthia, help a brother out. I don't know where you at, but if you somewhere close, or maybe I can come to you, man. I need this something. I can do something like how they do in the West Coast, like braid it out, 
like had them little braids up top or something, or I can dread it down or something, baby girl. Uh, two strand twist, baby girl, help me out, man. I see you over here promoting your business, Cynthia African hair braiding, help a brother out. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get to your questions. Your questions was, are you single? Yes, I'm single. Uh, I'm single. I'm not really looking. So, yeah. Um, let's keep going. Um, where are you from? I'm from North Carolina. How do you start your videos? Um, I pray. But I just get lit. Like, I walk around, like, my... I walk around my living room real quick, you know what I'm saying? Get lit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then I just sit in front of him, sit in front of my color, and just start talking to y'all, man. Put on my, my little lights, you know what I'm saying? Make sure I look good, you know what I'm saying? And then... Uh, I don't really, I don't really do my videos over, like, once I hit record, I just go, like, it's just one take, only way I can do two takes is maybe if I didn't hit record or the, maybe the battery died, but it's all, it's always one take with me, cause at the end of the day, I can go in, when I edit, I can edit out what I don't want, but a lot of times, I just like it to be natural, I don't want it to come over here and just be all, like, computerized, like, yes, it has to be like this, this, this. nah. I want y'all to get me. So when y'all see me in real life, y'all know what y'all getting. It's not no, oh, he's acting like this on camera, but no, nah, y'all get the real who I am for real. Uh, when's your B-Day? Uh, my birthday is April 20th. Um, how tall are you? <laughs> I am 6'3". On a good day, a brother would be 6'4". Like if I'm wearing some Tims and, and, and I really pick, pick my hair all the way up, I'll be 6'4". But I'm 6'3". I'm 6'3". My mom asks, do you like older women? Yep. <laughs> like what, what Trey Song said? Yep. Yeah. Hell yeah, I do. Honestly, well, for the past, um, yeah, for the past, for the past year, maybe a year and a half, all I've been, all I've been talking to is older women. So. Oh, uh, damn, I'm trying to, I'm trying to wink at your mama. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so what we got? Um, okay, Skate Gang, man. What's going on? Play a partner, partner, player. Hey, man, make sure y'all go subscribe to my boys over there, man. Skate Gang, man. Go, man, go subscribe to him, man. Because that boy, man, he really, man, he really got it going on, man. Bro, bro's really dedicated, man. Y'all go subscribe to his channel. Um, he says, where do you see yourself this time next year? Now that's crazy. I don't want to say something and then it don't happen. But um, this time next year, this time next year, I see myself. I don't know. This time next year, I, this time next year, I think I'm. I'm I think I'm. A, I'm gonna have maybe over a hundred thousand subscribers. I really think so. I think I'll have over a hundred thousand subscribers by this time next year. I think I'll still be doing YouTube. If y'all want me to, y'all gotta y'all gotta keep subscribing. Y'all gotta keep liking my videos. Like the more y'all like, the more I can just keep going. But if y'all stop liking, then you know I might quit. <laughs> All right, what's your goal for now? Um, this is my goal. I I think we. Oh, this is uh, okay. This is Amar Merrick. Amar Merrick. This is his, um, Amar Merrick's question. He says, "What's your goal for now?" All right, my goal, as I guess you're asking as far as YouTube, my goal for YouTube is to, I just want to establish myself as somebody where if you want to get your content out, you can just come to me to get your content out. But I also want to become successful in this. Like, I really feel like this is something that you can really, like, it, like it's hard to get in front of a camera and talk. So, and then to put yourself out there and have, like, millions of people watching you. So my goal is to be able to use my platform to help get, you know, sp spread awareness or to also, I just, I just, I don't know. I just want to be helpful. I don't know how or what, but it's just, cause y'all can see by the, the videos I'll be uploading. Like I upload funny stuff, but every once in a while I'll come and upload something educational or in my videos, I might say something like, oh, this is what's going on on top of maybe doing a funny video. So I just want to use my platform to make sure that I can get certain things across and certain things heard. That's my goal for this. Like, because I know the internet is so powerful, I don't want to play with it. All right, we have Megan Hardigan. Okay. Okay, shout out to. Oh, she said, hey, shout out 
Megan Kelly. So, shout out to Megan Kelly. Um, how long have you been doing YouTube? I've been doing YouTube for about two months now. Yep. Okay, this is from Yolanda Lattimore. Miss Yolanda. <sighs> Miss Yolanda. Mm -hmm. She said, what is, okay, she said, what is it that you're most good at? It can be anything from sports, music, sex, etc. <sighs> hmm. The best thing I'm good at is creating. Like whatever, whatever it is that's creating, it can be music. I'm very, I, I think I'm good at creating music. Um, I'm just good at creating stuff. Like it can be music. It can be, um, it can be a play. Like anything that deals with entertainment, like acting. I mean, coming up with a storyline, um, coming up with um, a song, uh, maybe coming up with a cartoon, maybe coming up with a book idea, coming up with a car design, like anything that deals with something creating, like coming up, brainstorming. There we go. I'm very good at coming up with ideas and like, like just, just get it started. So that's what I'm, I'm good at, like brainstorming, coming up with ideas, like getting it popping. You know, like when I was in school, group assignments, man. I be doing like most of the goddamn on work, but I be coming up with the ideas and stuff. So that's what I'm good at. Uh, we got a question. I'll give you a shout out. Okay, we're giving a shout out to Christian um, Baista. Christian, yeah, Christian ba Baista. Shout out to you. I don't know if you're a female or a dude, but shout out to you. I, I need y'all to start get, getting some profile pictures so I know if y'all are female or male so I can address y'all right because I don't, you know, there's ways you talk to a female than you talk to a male, so. All right, we have a question from uh, T. How many licks does it take to get to the center of the Tussie Roll Pop, girl? Girl, come on now. We already know it takes a <laughs> Hey guys, as y'all know, we are coming out with merchandise with Twa Hoodies. So what I need is I need somebody out there to come up with a logo for with Twa family. I need somebody to come out with a logo that we can use for the hoodies. Um, go ahead and get down in the, um, my email. Put it, send it to my email. My email is Mr. Twa at gmail.com. So make sure y'all get in there. If y'all have a, a a sketch or even a, a idea or something you know send it to us so we can go ahead and work this out because we're trying to come out with what twa family merchandise man it's gonna be lit man can you imagine like walking around with twa family stuff and people asking you like yo what is that blah, blah, blah. Be like yeah i'm a part of a family yeah yeah i'm part of a family you know what i'm saying so y'all let me know man it's your boy man if i did not answer a question that you wanted answered then go ahead and type the question down in this comments now because I'm going to do another q and in a in maybe in a couple of weeks. I'll do another Q&A. If we can get enough questions down there, I'll do another Q&A. I might even go somewhere crazy and do it. You know what I'm saying? So I just want to do the first Q&A here because at the end of the day, if anything happens where, you know what I'm saying, we move our location, then at least I know the first Q&A was done at the original Watoa family video every year. So until then, man, it's your boy, Mr. Watoa, and I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow. Why? Because we family. Watoa!